welcome to this short introduction on Canopy Scripts. Canopy Scripts will help you automate workflows in Canopy. This can include activities like starting and stopping measurements with custom pre-processing and post-processing steps, performing calibration upload and download sequences, data import, export, and conversion tasks, this includes operating on calibration data files and operating on measurement data files. Running test sequences and controlling ECU inputs, such as running bench, hill, or dyno tests, or software unit test. You can automate data analysis tasks and data mining with scripts and do automatic report generation. Scripts are created using the CASEL programming language. CASEL is very much like C, but with many extras designed to help you get things done in Canopy. You can edit and execute scripts from the Tools tab on the Canopy ribbon. In Canopy, to create a new script, I go to the Function Editor. And if I look in the Navigation tree under Scripts, under Project Directory, I can right-click and pick New and give my script a new name, such as Calibration Sequence. And here in the editor pane, I would enter the source code for my script. Uh, in the uh, interest of time, I'm going to cheat here, and I'm going to paste source code for a script I have written beforehand and bring it in here. And what the script is going to do is start a measurement and then run for a period of time with a sequence of different calibration data files. So I'll load calibration data file number one and run for five seconds, load calibration data file number two and run for five seconds, load calibration data file number three and run for five seconds, and then I will stop the measurement. I can compile the script to test it and make sure I have no syntax errors. That worked, that's good. So I can save it, and this will save the script as a .cns file in the project folder on my hard drive. We'll need to know that later on. So I exit the function editor, and then back in Canopy on the ribbon, on the Tools tab, I can pick the Execute command, and I can find the script that I just created, calibration sequence.cns, and I can run it from here, and it will start the measurement running and load some calibration data and then change the calibration data and run a final set of calibration data and then stop the measurement. And that's my script.